speed on here okay now I did some settings changes um, in the profiles and this is camera one here's camera two and uh, it's just like they were a while ago now we'll go to the desktop and see I can't show anything in the profiles while I'm recording so I'll go over here and show my screen uh, screenshots now this is a previous screenshot and that encoder I'm using is XT64 and it's set on in for streaming service encoder settings. I thought maybe, you know, the encoder, well, some of the stuff I read when I was researching the problem here, um, and, you know, pointed back to some of that sort of thing. But I changed all that back and forth and it didn't help. Uh, I forgot the details. You, I think I can, well, some of it you can look, you can't look while you're recording. You can't even, you know, like you hit the drop down list or anything. But anyway, I'm pretty sure that's not the problem. I really think it's uh, it happened. And here you can go into the advanced, and you can either do advanced or simple, and that is in advanced. Okay, now here's what I did. This was the other day when I what how I, um, I imported. A, I had these three three different profiles. The untitled was the default, you know, uh, that that came with it. And I imported my profile, and I had one that said uh, backup, one that said primary. And I had noticed that uh, it didn't. Uh, I, what I had intended was I, t I saved. Uh, I got in the backup one I named backup, and then I saved uh, in the settings uh, that it was a backup stream. So it wasn't supposed to start streaming unless the primary stream went down. And uh, but I noticed that it would no matter which one I was on, it would just start streaming. So I didn't bother with. I just, you know, I didn't. Have, I didn't feel like I had time to mess with it, so I left it like that. And so what I think I've figured out is that the scene collections is where you need to save those sort of settings. Uh, well, I could have got in there and then saved just a different scene. I think is what I needed to do. Um, I had. I think I knew about that at one point, but I forgot or something. It must have been a long time ago too, because I don't have any backups until the other, the other day. I noticed the scene collections and import and export. And so anyway, I went. Um, this is while I'm importing scenes and where what I went and got, and uh, so I ended up. Um, this may be sort of backwards. Okay, now there's a scene collection. The untitled is blank. Um, it's the default scene, and I, instead of editing it manually, I imported a scene. And so at some point, I knew how to do that, and I did it. <laughs> there, and then I forgot about it. Forgot to go backing them up, so you can uh, export them. So that would be that's how you would back them up, you know. So um, the untitled is just black, um, and then there's just a screenshot of a desktop screencast. Looks like okay. Now here you go. Uh, yeah, that's today. Oh, yeah, the date should be at the top. Well, those are all today. But anyway, I'm looking at the date at the top, you know, of the computer screen there. I wasn't earlier. Let's go back and see. Yeah. Oh, that's the date. I need to be looking at this date right here. Yeah, see, that was this 19th. The one of today uh, <coughs> is always going to stay the same. <coughs> i get a drink. <coughs> Yeah, so these were previous work, and then that was the 19th, and then 19th still. It was throwing me off a little bit because I didn't expect those to connect. Uh, when I started paging through my screenshots, I thought there'd be some in between. I was like, how come I seeing these? But so that's when I was just looking at the different uh, scene collections, and that is, yeah, the desktop, and then that is still on the 19th. And see, I had uh, all those different... Uh, Different pro they have the same name, but they are different profiles. But those two were connected together, and I think what caused that was in my backups. I uh, this one right here. I thought, well, I wanted to, uh, and also saved that untitled scene in there. But I thought I saved twice into that same folder. I thought it would just make another a second set. Or, or overwrite this set. I really thought it was overwrite this set, but it didn't. It made it into a double scene. Really weird. So, um, I've been, I mean, that's not what broke it. It was already broke before then. Uh, let me see if I can get into the screenshots again. 
Are those things... I'm not sure if they're full screen or what. Oops, that closed the application. Dad, damn it. That's the only application that does that. All right, let's see. Go back to the screenshots. This one acts a little funny. It's most of the time it goes. I'm just going to go real faster here to get back to. Then we're at the 19th again. Most of the time it goes by date. Uh, I think you can change how you want it to do, but not always. Sometimes it, it's really weird. I don't know. I know, uh, uh, but it opens quickly and works well. And uh, for something gone wrong with um, my favorite one, Gwenview, uh, it takes forever to open up. It uses too much resources, so I don't use it as my default anymore. Sometimes I open it when I just really want to make sure I'm going by date and not by name or anything. Anyway, yeah, we're still back on the 19th there. Get back to where it changes. Okay, the 25th, that's today. Okay, so um, I imported one, a new one because, uh, well, I couldn't, I, I imported, I couldn't delete them. I couldn't do anything with this double one here. You can't get it to unselect. You're supposed to be able to click on the check mark and deselect and deselect. Well, if you click on one, it'll take them both. So it's kind of confusing. So I was trying to remedy that. And see, now there's three because I imported one. So importing another one from a different folder didn't help. Uh, tried removing, and it didn't help. So then I went over and I checked the other. And I wanted to double check. I was today. I wanted to double check that that was blank like I thought. And so that's the one that has, that's the one I had imported. That's the one. And every time I edit my scenes, it saves it in there automatically. Well, if I did it in there, it would save it in there. But, uh, you know, I don't want to start from scratch. I've got so much in there. So then I decided to rename these. See, now I have three all checked, and I couldn't uncheck them or do anything. So I renamed them, and I, rena and I named the, whichever one it selected as one, and now I've got it. And see, now I can switch. When I switch to that one, I get that one by itself. If I switch to either one of those, I get both of them. So then I went on and renamed again, and now I've got three separate selections I can make here. And so... I just I started to delete all but one, and I thought, well, you know what? Now that they're separate, uh, what if I mess something up? I'll just leave them in there until I'm done, <laughs> you know. So I've got uh, <clears throat> the strange thing is, whichever one of those profiles you're on doesn't seem to make any difference. I thought it did. I, I think when you import them initially, it does. I'm pretty sure that's. I don't know. Maybe I did. Yeah, I probably imported my profile and then imported scene collection separately and I just didn't remember that and I forgot to back up my scene collections so uh, now every time I you know I was thinking that <clears throat> I could just what I've been doing for trying to back it up was exporting my profile but that wasn't getting it all so your profile and your scene collections are separate things and uh, so <clears throat> pay attention to that if you want to you know try to import export or back them up and all that sort of thing which if you change from one machine to the other, like I did, you know, I reformatted a Fedora 23 on the same machine to, or, you know, to Fedora 28, but also I have imported a profile into, say, like Mom's machine so that I could use it in there. Uh, it works well. There was a few things that didn't come in, and I had to manually do it, but it does work. So anyway, <clears throat> now, uh, at the desktop, this is what I've got. I've got only audio from... Uh, the lapel from the cameras I have is audio cam 2 in here but they're all named the same <clears throat> and uh, so I decided to just put it on profile the one I renamed to profile 1 uh, that way I know it doesn't matter the, the thing that was confusing the heck out of me is it doesn't matter which one of those folders well so well, let's go into them. <clears throat> it doesn't matter which one of these folders I go to I still get the same profile so it doesn't actually help you to keep saving them over and over, evidently. Uh, it's quite confusing, actually, as to what, what's going on here. So, uh, oh, that's my browser. So that's the end of those profiles. That was my browser permissions and stuff. <coughs> Different subject. <coughs> um, so, but I made a folder for scene collections and backed up the one I'm using into there. So let's go in there and, and just for next time we want to 
Uh, and I did confirm before I started <clears throat> that it does crash still. It doesn't get fixed by update or anything. It does crash if you hit stream. And what I think I remember <clears throat> is, uh, yeah, I just remembered I probably have a video about that. Well, I didn't ever go try to look through my own videos to help myself. Uh, maybe I'll have to, but I think I know what to do. I need to uh, rename every one of these it just says see what I did is I've copied and pasted them from there was only one in there I believe uh, on one like the camera 2 scene I think uh, this one here which you can't see when I do that you see the camera but uh, <clears throat> well, I think I'd, what I need to, what I'm gonna do I just uh, is rename each one of these audio cam to uh, to I'll say to desktop and uh, Let's see, filters, properties, I don't know if you can rename up, I right click to get that, yeah, so, rename, <clears throat> it's not letting me rename though, did I miss click something, could be because I'm, I don't, I think you can do it while you're on it, maybe you can't do it while you're on it, there you go, yes you can, to desktop, and this, the each one's going to have to be something different, I think. And uh, <clears throat> so um, I'm going to go ahead and just go. I'll stop the video here because you won't be able to see what I'm doing. Well, you'll be able to see some of it, but that's the idea. I'm going to go into every one of these scenes now, and that's what I didn't want to do. So I come up and done it, and I didn't want to spend forever. But it's uh, really being a pain not being able to stream. So if that'll fix it, that'll be worth it. And uh, <clears throat> also, I'm going to add. Uh, audio from cam one if it works I'll add audio from cam one and plug the uh, plug the mic into cam one and then I'll just start using it as audio only most of the time or you know whenever I need audio from the lapel mic because if when they're plugged in um, okay I'll go ahead and switch over okay, I'll I'm go ahead and switch the, over uh, I'm gonna turn on the both uh, that's both of them. Now there's audio cam too, but but I have the power adapter plugged in, the USB cable going to the you know the power supply, well, the AC to DC converter, and it makes a very slight, not very loud, but just audio a buzz in the audio, and it's just I just don't I'm not going to settle for that. <clears throat> so um, it doesn't matter what scene you're on if that. Uh, because the audio is all coming from the same one. It's coming from camera two. And all I have to do to get rid of that buzz is unplug the power. But then the camera, with the camera running, it goes down and, 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 shuts, the, and shuts off the app in 10 minutes or 20 minutes or whatever. It, ha it happened the other day. I, I, try, I was making a video and I thought, okay, I just don't, just remember to not stay that way very long. You can do audio all day. You can do eight hours easy <clears throat> and uh, I, I thought it was five hours but you can do eight the other day I did eight hours on camera two anyway could have been a different on camera three but uh, it's the one I was using until the battery went started you know puffing up and getting dang looking like it, it decided it was too dangerous to keep using it's got it's outgassing is what they call it but uh, <clears throat> anyway um, so I decided after trying out the tablet, and it go, it'll go about 10 minutes max, and then it gets so far behind. Let's see how this one's doing. Oh, it's not doing any better. It's doing that. Maybe either one of them's going to work. <clears throat> it was okay a while ago when I started. Sometimes if you just switch, you know, back to the desktop or another camera, it'll straighten up. So let's let's see what's going on with that. Camera one. It's a, that's about as good as they're going to be. Okay. Now let's go back to camera two. I don't know why I'm already waving. <clears throat> I don't know why I keep having this problem, but but the cam uh, this one seems to work better. Or, or I've been using this is the one I've been using for well, ever since I set all this up, like two or three years now. It seems to work better than the tablet does, as far as not getting behind. I mean, it gets behind. Sometimes it gets behind, then it gets better again. And there's a lot of fluctuations in the Wi-Fi speeds. So I've gone over that a lot, but. Um, and you can see the difference right here. If I get on both of them and I'll just start waving, see? Well, now see, it's not super as off as I thought it was in, in that scene. But uh, but you can definitely see that the one behind me is, is not 
you know, my hand's not coming up as quick as the one looking straight at me. So, <coughs> anyway, I'm going to switch the, um, what I'm planning on doing is, um, right now the camera's plugged in, the audio lapel mic is plugged into this camera, camera two. And I need it the most for, well, most of the time. Uh, well, especially the videos I'm doing right now, I want to show when I'm rebooting the machine and everything, you know. And I'm mostly that's what I do is desktop videos and then I, you know, I'm working on machines and when I want to reboot them and show that, and show some, when I don't have remote desktop running on that other machine, when I'm working on another machine besides this one, which is most of the time, um, uh, you know, I need a view of the camera. And I'm, I guess I'm going to go ahead and buy some kind of camera that's a lot better quality so I can, you know, show the monitor. I need an optical zoom is what I've, I've decided. Uh, anything with a digital zoom is just not going to going to hack it. Well, um, I mean, maybe if you had something that was 10 megapixel or something plus, you know. But if you're going to do that, you're probably going to have d optical zoom anyway. So uh, definitely not going to hack it on this. Ca these phones are 5 megapixel, but they only do about 2 on the video. The tablet's 8 megapixel. And I, I would have guessed it does around 5 on the video. I've seen, I've looked at the specs before, but I forgot. Uh, but with the optical zoom, neither one of them, you know, the 10-inch the does look better, but then it gets behind quicker. So I don't know if it's the Wi-Fi chip or just the, uh, on the camera or, it, like, again, my my, mo my router should be able to handle it just fine. It's supposed to do 1,200 megabits. And let's say it only does half of what it's supposed to, which I, it should do about at least three-quarter of what it's supposed to, then it uh, it still should handle it. So uh, at 720p, I'm not doing 1080p. I can't do 1080p. So that's the other thing. I think if I got, I'm a, I, I keep, see, uh, like I could get security cameras. I'm off about my plans now. If I get security cameras that do 1080p and are wired and not Wi Fi, and then I should be able to, in theory, be able to get, I might be able to use 1080p then, but I still won't have optical zoom. So, and I can't set the, these, the way these cameras uh, generally are, they need to be right here where my hand is in order to not have to zoom in. Well, I can't have it there, you know, I just don't have a way to do that. I mean, even if I had some arm to hold it right here, I'd bang my head into it every time I moved, you know, so <clears throat> I just can't find a way to do it. If I put it up over my head, then I couldn't get up out of the chair, you know, so sometimes I knock that thing over when I forget to shove my chair too back. That, so that silver stand behind me, that's a mic stand holding the, the, this camera right here. Sometimes I bang into it when I get up, so. Uh, <clears throat> So, right now, I'm not going to, I don't want to buy, yeah, that's why I don't want to spend money buying a battery for camera three, <coughs> so I can just go back to using it for audio, because <coughs> I think I'm going to get something. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, <coughs> some kind of new camera. I'll, you know, I start thinking, well, if I'm going to spend money on a camera, I'd like to have a, I'd like to have a DSLR that would do, a, I'd like to have a 4K DSLR so that it'd be a little more future proof and, you know, a nice optical zoom and everything. Uh, but but you can't get one of those for under 500 bucks, really, maybe four. Uh, that's just too much for me to spend. Um, so then you go like 175 or so for like a 1080p. But then it's not too many of either one of them that are, some of them will do, I've seen a couple here and there that would do Wi-Fi streaming, but they don't any of them have, you know, wired Ethernet. That's just not in fashion now. Mostly the Wi-Fi is just to download files and stuff, though, so it wouldn't work for my situation. So anyway, I've gone on and on about this, actually, and sometimes I start rambling like this at the tail end of videos that have nothing to do with this. But okay, so I'm going to go here. And rename everything, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go up, stop the video, rename everything, bec and then come back because you know you can't see. There's a few scenes where you'd see what I was doing, and but most of them you won't. <clears throat> so there's really no point. Because I did a, I did that in a video recently, and I was like, man, it's not too great to do that. Okay, so I'm gonna go, and then I'll come back. <coughs>